good morning. It is another work day, so I got up at 6.30, straightened my hair, and now it's time to make some coffee because I need it. I haven't had coffee in the morning, I think in the last two days, and I really miss it, so I'm like, I'm gonna make some coffee today. Wednesday so that means tomorrow is my Friday so I'm so so happy about that <sighs> I just have so many things to do here at home our kitchen I think I told you guys I don't remember is finally remodeled <gasps> oh I have to tell you guys something super important I know a lot of you are keeping up with my NP journey and finally I got the acceptance from the school I kept like literally bugging them like emailing them over and over because I didn't I wasn't hearing anything and I was like hello like if you guys want me to put the preceptor information at least four months ahead and I'm supposed to start in January like how is that gonna happen if you guys haven't even accepted me into the school you know obviously I didn't say it like that but I said it in a professional way <laughs> like that so anyways they finally accepted me into the school so now I have to enroll. I just haven't had time because I've been working and I've been doing a little bit of overtime here and there this week. Um, but sometimes it's like overtime. I'm like, is it really worth it? Sometimes it's just, it's not really worth it because you get taxed out anyway. So it's like, I mean, the extra money is nice, but at the same time, if you really, really think about it, you get the time and a half of the overtime and then it's like, you get taxed out like so much money <laughs> so it's like do i really even get overtime i don't think so i think it's just all taxed out so anyways i only did like 30 minutes here and there this week um but of course it adds up so anyways but the point is that i have been accepted back into np school and i am just so excited you guys because as you guys know or if you don't know i only have two classes left and there are two clinical rotations and two classes and um, I should be done by the summer or the fall of next year and I just like honestly I don't know where life will take me and I don't like I've said before I don't even know if I want to work as an NP right now but there's just so many more future career options available um, if I just finish the degree plus it's like I've already wasted so not wasted but I've already spent you know my money on it because I didn't get any loans or anything I'm paying out of pocket so I might as well just finish it but yeah I'm excited I am gonna have to start putting in my preceptor information I looked at it last night and they want me to put in like all my immunization record which is has already been done and I don't understand why they want me to do it again so I'm gonna have to email them again. So with that being said, with my little story, make sure you are following up with people. Like if you have important things that you want to be done, you gotta follow up because nobody cares as much as you do. And uh, like, if you gotta bug them, you gotta bug them. So that's what I did and I finally got accepted back into school and now I'm just, now I have to do my part and finish all this stuff that I need to submit, um, which I'll probably do on Friday but anyways, I'm running a little late, so let's go to work. I'm going in at 8.30 today. I'm not planning to do overtime today, so it's like I'm good enough, you know? I'm good. I'm good. Plus, I only have one chart for tomorrow, so it shouldn't be that bad. And, of course, they're going to add on more patients um, because there's usually a lot of add-ons, and I still work tomorrow, so I'm sure I'll be busy anyways. <laughs> So I ended up mixing protein powder and greens 
with water, it's actually not that bad. So this is my breakfast. Finally out of work. It was a good day today, but honestly, <laughs> just wanted to be home. I think we all get those days. Like there's just days that you're like, I just want to go home now. It was one of those days. So heading home now. So damn tired. Um, but I can't go to sleep. And of course my dog's here again. Hi there. Hello. He always comes and greets me. Oh, where is he? Right there. Hello, sweetie. He always comes in and greets me and runs after me. And if I don't open the door, he will start crying. Uh, I really just wanted to stay here and do nothing but i have to go inside <laughs> and change i have to change because i'm gonna go to the gym so i'm gonna go change really quick actually i'm gonna take some pre-workout too because apparently my boyfriend wants to go to the movies after the gym which if you didn't know i honestly hate going to the movies but he wants to go see a movie, so I'm like, okay, fine, let's go. Even though I do work tomorrow, but God, I hate going to the movies. I just don't understand why people like going. It's like, why go? Oh my God, he's calling me, hold on. Yeah? Hey, let's not, let's not go to the movies today. Really? Yeah, cause I gotta go, I gotta go to the tomorrow. To a what? I have to go somewhere tomorrow for work. Okay, okay, let's not go to the movies then. Yeah. Okay, then let me just. Okay, then can you. Are you gonna pick me up then? Yeah, I'll come get you. Okay, thank you. Bye. Okay. Yes! <laughs> We're not going to the movies. I am so happy. Okay, good. I just. God, I'm just hearing me saying that I don't want to go to the gym I mean to the movies and then here we are anyways like I was saying though I do hate going to the movies I'm gonna go probably this weekend um, for my cousin's birthday because she wants to go but I hate going because I don't understand why pay money to like sit in an uncomfortable seat and just watch a movie like I don't understand like I want to be like laying down in my couch with my blanket with my own snacks like why pay money to go do that i don't know i, I just don't understand do you guys hate hate going to the movies too like because i totally totally hate it <laughs> but anyways he wanted to go so i was like okay fine if i'm gonna go this weekend with my cousin like if you want to go i'll go with you like i'll compromise but yeah don't really like going but I'm gonna go inside. Yay! And now I don't have to drive over there. He's just gonna pick me up. But I gotta take pre workout because I am tired. See, in the blink of an eye, I am dressed for the gym. Gonna get some pre workout. Where is my cup? Let's see. We'll do. Uh, we'll do this one. My water. Oops, I'm not even in frame. Seriously? Whoa, I don't want to drop you guys. There, am I in frame now? No. Nope. Whatever. Okay, as long as you guys can hear me. So, I think I'm just going to do half a scoop because if I take a whole scoop, lately when I do that, I can't sleep if I take a full one. So I'm just going to do half. And I could link the video where I talk about it um, down below for you guys. Let's just chug it. All right, you guys, I got distracted trying to edit this video. My boyfriend's not here. I have my headphones and let's go. Oh. Hello. I need my face mask. Why? Huh? I don't want to go. Now I have to go. Way too many people are here today. I only did 30 minutes of elliptical and like 40 of the arc trainer. I think that it's 
That's what it's called. It's like the elliptical. But there's way too many people. Way, way, way too many. I got the Italian BMT. I got a foot long because I want to take the other half to work. That way I don't have to worry about it. And then I'm gonna. I got some broccoli and cheese. No book. Broccoli and cheddar soup that I'm also gonna take to work. And of course, some jalapeno chips. So it's almost 11 p.m. I am so tired. My legs are so sore. I took magnesium and Tylenol. Hopefully I can have a good night's sleep. We're gonna finish setting up the fire TV stick. I think that's what it's called. I had Roku, but my boyfriend ended up buying like a the fire TV. I think that's what, that's what it's called. So he's setting it up in the living room and in my room. And yeah, I'm excited because I was having trouble with the Roku. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this day in my life. Make sure to like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, and I will see you guys on my next video.